Hello Ample players, Reverend here, and today I'm going to be explaining a brand new feature available in all Ample Sound guitars. It is the Tab to MIDI Export feature. The first thing you'll do is open your interface, go to the Tab display, and you will see two new buttons here. Now I have a little tab loaded. I'm going to play the tab and then explain what the buttons do. Okay, now the, the first button, this is the export button. You simply drag this button to your MIDI track to export the data. Now that export was done in one of two modes and the mode button determines which mode you're exporting in. So what we just did is we exported in channel mode. Now in channel mode, it means that information will be coming in on different channels, different MIDI channels, and you can see that here. This one is on two, this mm -hmm. one is on four, for example. So to make sure that you hear all the data on all channels, set your I MIDI input to any right here. Another thing to notice in this data is the number of key switches shown in this key switch range. I'm gonna bring that up again in a minute. Now the channel mode is not supported for Ableton Live and Pro Tools users. They will be exporting in the string man mode, which is the second of the two. So I'm just gonna get rid of the first one here and then export again using this arrow icon in string man mode. Now you'll immediately see the difference. There's a lot more information in this key switch range and that's why Ample Sound recommend that you export in channel mode because it's less cluttered and easier to edit. Now string man mode is the solution for Ableton Live and Pro Tools users. And when you use the string man mode, you don't need to set up any input. That's it from me. I'm gonna leave you with this little tab. Thanks for watching.